What's up, guys? It's your boy Chance, also my Shadow Blade from Bloodshot Records, and I know it's been a minute since I've done, like, you know, anything like this. Um, as you guys know, I've been, you know, recording a lot, which here in a little bit, I'm gonna, I will be recording a brand new song, so I'll be ready for that. But, uh, I just wanted to, wanted to, to talk about, you know, being fair. Something that has not been happening at all. But uh, as you guys know, I have been approached by Tech Nine's record label, Strange Music, on a few occasions actually. And every time they just don't seem to work out. But here's why, and this is exactly what pisses me off. And I know a lot of you guys from Strange Music are watching this, so listen up. And Tech, if you are watching this, this is for you. Like, I'm not taking aim at you, Tech Nine. Fucking love your music, man. But this is aimed at those that are claiming to be members of your staff. Um, the one thing that just really pisses me off is you guys... And that claims strange music. You offer me a contract. Two million dollars, right? You offer me a two million dollar plus contract. To sign me. And then, you know, I take you up on that offer. And then what do you do? You turn around and say that you're not going to sign me. Like, you see my performance with dubstep. You like what you hear. You say that, you know, my raps, you know, what'll work. And you're right. Maybe in some areas they do. But what you don't realize is the kind of music that I do when I spit bars for my fans, when I do my raps for my fans, they're not just, you know, your average, you know, bullshit or whatever song. They actually have meanings behind them. If you read between the lines hard enough, you'll see that every song that I release has a, a very serious message behind it. And guess what? That's what the fans want. I give the fans what they want. They wanted me. They want the real me. They want me to... You know, talk about the issues that I go through and stuff like that. And that's exactly what I do. See, I give the fans what they want. But you guys, however, are not. You say that my raps didn't work. Well, fine. Hook me up with somebody that's willing to help me become better. Instead of just turning me away like you do. Ask anybody that knows me. Anyone. Ask any of my my friends, my family, my fan base. Ask anyone that knows my music, whether they're brand new to it or whether they've been listening to it for a long time. You know, I take my music seriously, and my music has real meaning behind it. It might not be up to standard to what you want and what you think it should be, but if you really listen to it, you'll see that there's a message behind every song that I released. Whether, you know, whether the message is saying I hate you to one of my exes, or whether it's a positive one saying, hey, even though this is a dark song, this is meant to convey positivity. So 
So, Tech, no offense to you, man, but honestly, dude, you need to find new staff. Like I said, no disrespect towards you, Tech Nine. I love your music, man. I was absolutely huge fan. Especially when you did that collaboration with my brother, with my brother Matt. That was super cool. I really enjoyed that PTSD collab. That was super dope. Absolutely loved it. And, you know, like, yeah, I am a Tech Nine fan. Don't get me wrong. But honestly, Tech, you need to find new staff for your record level, man, because these guys. They say one thing to everyone's face, and then they turn around, and then they spit in that person's face. And this hasn't just happened to me. This has happened to several people that I know. And honestly, I'm tired of seeing it. So for those of you that have been tricking us, you guys need to stop. You guys think it's all fun and games when you don't, and you don't think, you don't realize that that $2 million could change someone's life for the rest of their life. Especially someone like me who came up from nothing. Someone who, when he first moved here, lived out of the back of his mom's car for six months to a year. Okay, I went from having nothing to having even a little home studio still means everything to me. But yet, what do you do? You turn people like me away every day. Why, just because you guys think that they're not good enough? What if you guys did this? What if you didn't think I was good enough, but then you sent me over to tech and he thinks that I'm good enough? Then what? And you know what? I got something for you guys. <sighs> and this song right here is from not only my bro cryptic wisdom but also from myself taking aim at every single person who has ever tried to bring us down within the music community this is animal <laughs> Is that a rider? Forgot a bit. One of the hell is for real. 
be like a mob. We get in, get in, get in with the line. You wanna get with the women, they make me fine. You wanna get with the women, they make me fine. You wanna get with the women, they make me fine. Better yet.
Better yet, I got an even better one for you. Or do I need to bust out a song in honor of Mitch Walker to prove you guys wrong? You know, fuck it. Time to prove you guys on strange music that don't believe in me, time to prove y'all wrong. This is not only to prove you guys wrong, this is also for Mitch Luck. We passed away today back in 2012.
Actually, no. You know what? You know what? I got a better one. And what's up to all my Suicide Silence fans, man? I love you guys. And what up to every motherfucker out there who's a metalhead talking about music, man? Let's do this one not only to prove these guys wrong, but let's also do this for Mitch, man. Let's do it. Now it's really time to bring you guys down a notch. If you're not content to remain where you are, why should your teeth be? Invisalign clear aligners can shape your smile up to 50% faster. Don't let anything slow you down. Visit Invisalign.com. And this song right here is for anybody that's dealt with a horrible past. Yeah, you should. You drive me insane. Here we go!
Now, you guys still don't think I've got what it takes to make it? You guys are sadly mistaken, dude. So, Tech, I'm telling you, dude, if you were smart, you'll sign me yourself. And you'll ditch these guys that don't know what they're doing as far as promotion or bringing artists on. Like I said, I'm one of the best artists that you could ever come across. And I'm not about to sit here and waste my time with some losers. That don't know what the fuck they're doing. So to everybody out there that's been there. Has been you know tricked by these guys. I do apologize to you for that. I don't know why they're doing this. But. Tech on behalf of every artist that these guys have turned away. I just want to say one thing. You deserve better staff. Peace.